Finally, let's talk about testing your understanding. After employing the workable methods for building understanding that we have presented earlier, then it's time to test your understanding. You should be able to think through the subject as a chain of cause and effect from beginning to end. Try modeling different scenarios in your mind and see if the conclusions you get agree with the source materials and your experience. Since your aim in all this is to teach yourself a specific skill, the ultimate test of understanding is that you are able to perform the skill at a professional level of competence. This, this will take, take practice. practice. And, here's and here's one of my favorite, favorite sayings. sayings. In, In theory, theory, theory and practice are the same. same. In, In practice, practice they're, they're different. different. By, By Yogi Berra. Berra. Modeling, as, as powerful as it is, has, has to assume, assume that the subject exists in isolation, as, as in a laboratory setting. setting. That, that is, is the, the only way to reduce the number of variables to a manageable level. level. Be aware of your model's limits. Your model can never be completely perfect because in the real world your subject does not exist in isolation. It will be impacted by various situations and environments with results impossible to predict with complete certainty, but you can come very close.